Caught on camera, shoplifting at a Utah business, and the number of incidents is spiking. Still hurting from the pandemic, stores are begging people to stop stealing. Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Bree shows us how one Ogden shop came up with a creative solution to stop thieves. Endless indulgence has security down to a science. I think we have around 12 cameras now. Carrie Vondra says the first time someone stole from her store, she knew she had to do something. We decided, you know what, we're going to make you famous. And so we decided to start, we'll hang anyone's picture in the window for hopefully to deter people in the future, but also to let them know that we haven't forgotten about it because we can't raise the price of our inventory to cover theft. But even a dozen cameras can't stop this new kind of shoplifter. Now they come in with the coats on, the hoods up, sunglasses on, mask on, you can get absolutely no idea. One shop in Park City came up with a different solution, making some new rules. Splendor Beauty announcing last week that no one under the age of 15 can come in without a guardian. Groups can't be larger than four people, and anyone with a coat or bag has to check it at the door. I want to see fun, good people coming in all the time. As soon as you start stealing from me, it gets my hackles up and it changes my personality. Vondra says she hates having to put so much money and energy into preventing shoplifting, but she has no choice. We're struggling to stay alive for lack of support, and now people are stealing. Jenna Bree, Fox 13 News, Utah. The Utah Department of Public Safety's new Crime in Utah dashboard indicates Weber County has seen a rise in shoplifters over the past several years. Meanwhile, in Salt Lake County, the number of shoplifting cases has actually gone down year to year.